What's up, dudes? It's Pat, and welcome back to another video. Hey, guys. I thought Cloud was going to want to stay for the intro. It looks like he did not. So today, dudes, we are actually having an amazing vlog for you guys. It's actually a really weird vlog. We have a horrible story to tell you. No, it's like like it was horrible, but it's like one of those stories I'm going to tell people for the rest of yes. my life. <laughs> like, it's so weird. If you follow us on Twitter, you already know. So I posted about a week ago. We went to give blood, right? Yeah, just a normal routine blood exam. You know, they were just going to, like... Stab us with the needle and drain our blood. And that's exactly what happened. <laughs> sort of. Actually, it didn't happen to me. But, um, yeah, we were there, and then um, we kind of passed out. Yeah, so, rewind, like, seven years ago, I actually did pass out while they were do donating. No, while they were taking my blood. Oh, they were donating to you? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we thought that because Jen was looking at it while they were doing it, like, seeing the blood, we thought that's why she passed yes, out. Yes, apparently no, because I was not looking this time. And I still passed out. So this is what happened. I'm going to just go through the entire story. Plus, guys, we actually have footage. It's amazing. It's so scary and creepy. I'm, like, creepily looking at the wrong part of the camera at the same time. It's so sick. So you're going to see that in a minute. But this is what happened. So we went to get blood because we wanted to find out, are we healthy? We were going to, like, I haven't been to the doctor in five years. I could yeah. be dying for all I know. Who knows? I still don't know, by the way. <laughs> but um, this is what happened. So Jen was going to go first. She was going to get blood, right? Yeah. So, I actually was like, maybe I should go first. She's like, no, because I passed out last time. I'll yeah, go first. And that was a bad idea. <laughs> it was a really, really <laughs> bad idea. So, we told the lady she's passed out before, and she's like, oh, yeah, it'll be just it fine. It'll be just fine. We'll be done in no time. So, she started taking the blood, and she's like, wow, you might you be my... my new favorite patient. And then 10 seconds later, I was like, I don't feel so good. And then I passed out. I know. It was scary. I've never <laughs> seen anything like it before. I felt sick after, because she was... Jen was just there like That's this. That's how I felt. You looked like a ghost, or like you looked dead. No, this, your, your lips were white. I didn't even know that you passed out because I thought you were just giving a goofy face. Because <laughs> you were like you were like this, right? You were giving the blood, then all of a sudden you're like. <laughs> but then, oh my God, her lips turned white. Yes. White. Yes. Scary. You were even paler than normal, guys. Mind blown. <laughs> Is that even possible? <laughs> <laughs> Could have tried out for the Twilight movie. So the lady was like, oh, go get her some water. I was like, oh, God, oh, God, I ran in there. There's all people waiting in the waiting room. <laughs> That's where people wait. Yes. <laughs> and I was like, she passed out. And I grabbed the water and ran back in. And Jen, she was, Jen was conscious you when I got back. You should have just, like, thrown it right in my face. She probably would have drowned. Wake up. <laughs> so Jen was conscious, but, like, barely when I got back. So you were only unconscious for maybe 30 seconds. Yes. And then I heard, I started hearing a strange man's voice. I'm like, that does not sound like Pat. Yeah, so there was another guy there. He was holding her head up because she couldn't, like, keep it. Yeah. Alright, let's show Pretend you're dead. Okay. The other way. Oh. <laughs> this way, this way. And he was holding it like this. And I came back, and I was feeding her the water. Yes. And she's like, yeah. So they were like, do you want some water? And she's like, yeah, I have some water. No, but then I was fine. Like, five minutes later, I was fine. And then I was like, can you just finish, finish me? Just take the rest of my blood, please. And she's like, I can't do that. I can't. Don't me do that. That's what she said. She said, don't make me do that. Because the poor people there have, you know, they've experienced it before, but they have not experienced what you're going to hear next. Yes. No one has. No. So the thing was, Jen passed out, and I was like, oh god, that means I'm going to pass out. And yes. I was freaking out. He was already out. starting to look pale. He was sweating. I could see. He was nervous. I was so nervous. And I've given blood before just fine. And then, okay, so I went down to the seat. They put you in this, like, electric chair, basically. Yes, they like, strap you down. They strap you down. And I was like, okay, all right, I'm going to do this. I'm like, I'm thinking to myself, I'm going to pass out. But then I was like, you know, should I stop it? I'm like, no, I don't want to be a baby about it, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so the lady, she takes the thing. She shoves it into my vein. She's no, like. No, before she was even in, you're like, are you taking my blood yet? She's like, I'm not even in you yet. <laughs> okay, I couldn't look. I was, okay, this is what I was doing. I'm going to tell you exactly what I was doing. So I was like, I wasn't, she was over here, and I didn't want to look at her. Because yeah. I didn't want to see anything. So I was just like. Are you done yet? And then I said, I had my arm over here. I was like, do you, help, do you get some blood yet? You get some blood? And she's like, I haven't put it in you yet. And then she puts it in, right? Yes. And she's like, it's in, but for some reason, no blood's coming out. Yes. She said, it's directly in the vein, no blood. Nothing's com coming out. I think the blood in my body just froze yeah. as I was so, I was like dying. <laughs> oh my God. I was turning white, so she put it in. She couldn't get it out. And after that, she took it out. I was like, I'm not. I was like, no, then I said, are you going to put it in the other arm now? Yeah. And then, and then you passed out. Then I said, I don't think I'm feeling so good. <laughs> oh I was like, I don't, I don't think I'm feeling so good. <laughs> and I, then I had to grab his head. <laughs> so oh. I had told her beforehand, record it. 
if yes. I pass out, so the footage will pop up right now. It's okay. We do not accept insurance. You want some water? It's okay. Mike! Yeah. Yeah. I need you. Did you enjoy that? No, oh, I can't even watch it. It's, it scares me. Like oh, I'm I, not like seeing you like that. Like I knew that I was gonna pass out, so I was like, just record it yeah. so we can get the footage. But she didn't record the whole thing because it was starting to look cruel. Yes, it's just yeah, it was creepy. <laughs> so this is where things got really funny. So apparently I didn't know this, but I passed out twice. Yeah, you came back. You were back for like 10 seconds, and then you passed out again. I didn't even know that that had happened. So when, once I was back, I think you said like, can you hear me or something? Yeah. And I said yes, and then I said, you finish? I didn't even know I passed out. I thought they got all the they blood. They didn't take any blood. <laughs> I, I never got any blood taken, and I passed out. So Jen's was likely from taking the blood. Yeah, because they were taking so much, it was just spewing, spewing out. <laughs> me. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so I I never knew I passed out. I was like, did you did you finish? And they're like, we didn't start. <laughs> I'm like, oh. And then I lifted my hands up. There was sweat oh, everywhere. Yes. So I was so much sweat. And then within a couple minutes, I was feeling okay. Yeah. I was like, oh yeah, I feel good. Feel good. And then two minutes later, I said to Jen, I think I'm gonna have to sit here for about thirty minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and then a couple minutes later, I was like. Can you call them back in? <laughs> no, but apparently when I passed out and then like passed out a second time, they had already called an ambulance yes, for me. Yes, they did. But when I got back, they asked me about that and I was like, oh, cancel, cancel it. So they canceled it. So I was like, I'm not going to an ambulance. So we were there for like two hours. I actually had to go. I ran. I ran on over to Subway. I bought us some subs because we were actually fasting for the tests. And so we were pretty hungry, and I thought he should probably eat something. Hungry. Or I was starving. So I fed it. I fed him like a little baby, and he had food like, all over his whole body. There was lettuce and everything. I was like, I, they told me I had to so eat. Sad. They said I had to eat. I didn't want to eat. I actually moved to another room so that I could lay down because I was yes. like, I was like, I don't feel good. Can I go somewhere to lay down, please, please? And okay, this is the weirdest thing that ever happened. Like that feeling of when like a hand yeah. falls asleep. My whole body was covered in this feeling. My face, my nose. Goodness. And then like I started shaking. Oh. And I was like sitting there, and I was like, I hope I'm gonna feel better soon. <laughs> but you never did. And no, wait, we didn't get that for oh, you. No. Back up, I me mean, back. Back up. Back, back up a little bit here. They said no one has ever passed out and not felt better after. Yeah, because I felt fine after. I was just starving. Oh yeah, she like she was like. I scoffed down that stuff. And she was like, "Give me that pee cup. I'm heading to the bathroom." Right. Take my blood. Finish me off. But they wouldn't do that. They wouldn't do we actually it. had to go back the next day for that. Yes. But I was feeling so bad that I, like it was the place had already closed and I was still laying there. So I was like, okay, just. Call the ambulance. <laughs> that was like the last resort. Cause I'm honestly, I was barely conscious. Like I could barely tell what was going on. I was like, I was he like, looks, he looks awful. I, I was like this. He looks awful. For like two hours. <laughs> I didn't know what was going on. Then the ambulance came, and there was like, there were like 15 people. <laughs> there was a lot of people. There was a lot of people, and they were asking me all kinds of questions, and I was so out of it. They asked me my phone number. I said. I don't remember what it is. Oh I was how messed up I was. So and I blame I blame you and I blame the people that work there for feeding me that sub. They told me you needed food. And then I threw off on the way to the hospital. They, they drive were crazy. driving like maniacs. They got there in like 20 seconds. It was like 15 minutes away at the hospital. They got there in two minutes. It was how? How did they get there in two minutes? I was bouncing all over the place. It was crazy. They were there's all kinds of tubes and stuff in me. They were giving me water and stuff. I I had drank. <laughs> I had drank. But you said you felt a little better after you released the vomit. After, you know, after I was like, Ugh!
<laughs> we didn't get that on video. I'm so sorry, no, everybody. You're I'm welcome, sorry. actually. So Jan, um, she actually got to ride in the ambulance. Oh which yeah, was cool. that was an experience like, like no other. With, like 15 other people in there. <laughs> it was like the whole town was there. They were worried about me, obviously. So we got to the place. I was feeling a little bit better. They put me in a room, and then they did like a bunch of tests on me. They like checked my heart. They took some. They took blood again. And then they said, "You're fine. Get out of here." That's, that's a, exactly what they said. That's exactly what they said. I was like. Dead? <laughs> We're gonna have another. That's like, I don't wanna leave yet. I still feel sick. You have to get out. <laughs> no joke, that's what they said. That's exactly what they said. <laughs> um, and another clip will pop up right now. And in that one, I was just like laying there dead. Basically. You look better in that one, though. A I little better. Slightly better. <laughs> and then five minutes after that clip, they told me to leave. <laughs> right now <laughs> so um they tried to give me some food and drink i was i was like i was like dead i wanted to sleep is what I, I was like maybe i can sleep through this and we saw like 10 different doctors right yes everyone said you're fine time to get moving and i was like well can i just like sit here and rest for a little bit they're like no they said actually no, no. they said that they said actually no you can't oh, man. <laughs> so they actually no no, you can't hear. Let me get a wheelchair to wheel you out of the hospital. That's what they said. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. And I was like, I am not taking a wheelchair. And I was like, all the way to the Uber. All the way to Uber. And I had my throw up bag with me. And I was like, I'm sorry, Uber. I'm sorry. So I went home. I was like, I, like as I was waiting for Uber, I was kind of like, I looked like Golem. <laughs> out there and um so we didn't have our car because we went to yeah. the hospital so we went home i laid down i ate some raspberries and the raspberries cured you after four hours the raspberries <laughs> cured me miraculously <laughs> so then we took uber again we ubered back to where our car was in the middle of the night which looked creepy that it we did. even went to yes. take us to the middle of that park Take us to the middle of that parking lot now. <laughs> so, so he um he brought us there in the middle of the night. It was like I don't know, like one in the morning or something. Yeah. And then um we had our car. What did we do? We think we went to Walmart and got some food. I think so too, yeah. <laughs> got the we were starving. Um, but after that, I mean, I honestly I didn't record videos for a couple days I after. I know. I didn't feel good, but luckily we had videos for you guys who you missed luckily nothing. Luckily we were ahead. We were ahead on videos, but um, I mean that's pretty much the story. They said they've never had two people come before and both pass out. And we're just perfect for each other. We're both we're like... We're so weird. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> but um, basically guys, that's pretty much all there is to the story. Like so many people asked on Twitter, can we tell them what happened? That's what happened. That's exactly what happened. It was really, really <laughs> awful. <laughs> All my dudes, if you happen to be new to the channel and this is the first video you ever saw, definitely subscribe. Also, leave a comment down below saying that you subscribed. I will comment to as many of you guys as I possibly can. We truly appreciate the amazing support we on the love channel. You. We love every single one of you dudes. Yes, we do. And don't worry, guys. I am 100%. I feel better. No problems. But he's never, do he's never giving blood ever again. Like, ever again. Pat. Wake up! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking, but um, dudes, thank you so much for the amazing support of the channel, and we'll see you, dudes, next, next time! time.